Hello friends! Welcome to another craft video in our summer program. This week is Olympic week and I'm so excited about the Olympics you guys. I love to watch them. I think my favorite sports have to be diving and rowing but I'm a little biased because I used to do rowing. So today we are making an Olympic torch as you can see right here. So the things we are going to need for this craft we are going to need some gold paint, some glue or tape. I'm going to be using tape just because I think it'll work a little bit better, but you can also use glue. You're going to need some tissue paper in lots of different colors. I've got red, orange, and yellow. You can even do this if you have only one or two different colors. It doesn't matter too much. You're going to need a tube of some sort you can use a paper towel tube or a toilet paper tube, but either way, it will work. You're also going to want tea lights. You may or may not have these. If you don't, don't worry about it. This craft over here has a tea light, but it's dead, so it still works because look how beautiful of a flame that is. And then the final thing you are going to need is you are going to need a cupcake liner. Now we don't have cupcake cake liners here at the library. So if you take a look here, I've taken a coffee filter and colored it orange. So I'm going to do that once again for this craft. So step one for this craft, you are going to take your gold paint and your tube, and you're going to paint the tube gold, just like so. And once it's all painted gold, you're going to leave it to dry. Have I told you guys about Beanstack yet? I really love Beanstack. I think I'm winning a gold medal in reading right now, not to be too proud or anything. But what you can do is track your reading on the app. And for every second badge you earn, you can come into the library and pick up a prize. And once you have earned eight badges, you get an even bigger prize at the end. And if you're watching this video, you can already get one of your badges for watching a craft video. All right, I'm going to finish painting this tube and I'll come back to you when I'm done. All right, friends, as you can see, I have painted my tube a nice gold. I'm using my fingers on the inside to hold it so I don't get as much paint on my hands. I still get a lot of paint on my hands, but it's not as bad. I've decided that for this one, I think I'm going to paint my coffee filter gold. Now, if you have a cupcake liner that has a color, like if you have an orange or blue or red, really any color, you don't have to do this. You don't even have to do it if you have a white coffee filter, but I just think it would be lots of fun. And I do like to use the gold paint. So I will finish painting my coffee filter and come back. All right, so while you were working on getting all your stuff painted nice and golden, you're going to need to get some tissue paper in a few different colors. I have red, orange, and yellow here. And kids, I would recommend asking your adult to cut these, but if you're feeling confident in your cutting skills, you can just do it with an adult supervision. But you shouldn't do this alone because we don't want you to cut your little fingers. That wouldn't be very fun, then you'd ruin your craft. So you are going to take a little tea light. I've made sure that mine can light up. And you're going to take the tissue paper. I'm going to start with my yellow on the inside. And here, here is where you can use either your glue or your tape. I'm going to use tape just because my fingers are kind of sticky already. So I'm going to just rip a little bit of tape once I've got it peeled up. Just like so. Give it a little rip. I'm going to take my tissue paper and my tea light and I'm going to put my tissue paper on like this and I'm going to tape my tissue paper to my tea light. 
just like so. So you can see I have one corner covered. I'm going to go around and do this completely in yellow and then completely in orange and in red. I will come back when I'm done to show you what it should look like. All right, my friends. So I have finished here. So what I've done is finish taping all these nice little pieces of tissue paper around my tea light. And then what you're going to want to do is take your coffee filter or your cupcake liner, whatever you've used, and glue it on top of your roll. So once you have that glued on top, you can place your tea light and tissue paper right in the top there. You see it's glowing. And if you want to make it stick extra hard, you can try and sort of push it in and make sure that it's sort of snug within the tube. But if you can't do that, just rest it on top and be careful walking around. And that is the end of our Olympic torch craft. I hope you had such a fun time. I hope you're enjoying watching the Olympics and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.